Hello everyone. So today I want to talk about the future of Dawn of Fire. So we just got Gnarls on the continent not too long ago. Um, and now that Gnarls is on the continent, supposedly it's over. I think that they've probably seen the backlash from the community about the Hex. Um, unfortunately, the Wallbox lore is really integrated now, so I don't know if they can get around that, but hopefully there will be a Hex one day. Um, we have a Seasonals. No matter what you think of them, we have a Seasonals. And I'm not really sure what else I could add to the content. It seems pretty full. So, like, other than the Hex. So, like, it... Looks like the end for Dawn of Fire, so... I don't know, like, we have Prismax, and then... It just seems like Dawn of Fire is close to... Done with these updates, and we have to see what's next for Dawn of Fire, and it looks really hopeful. But... It's really just a mystery what's gonna happen. And... I think... If they wanna keep Dawn of Fire going... They're gonna have to do something and if they do keep going what what would they add so today i'm just going to talk about the general future of you know this game my son monsters 2 basically it's a prequel but you know the second like mainline msn game i don't think we'll ever get free um anyway so dawn of fire it we have a few prismatics, of course. We'll get those. But it's kind of ending, so... I think... As you may have seen by the thumbnail... I think... In order... Financially... This game... Doesn't... Probably doesn't make as much money as MSM. MSM probably has more players, like a lot more. I'd say, well, I don't know, but I just assume so. And it has the Steam version. So I don't think financially it makes sense to keep Dawnfire keep going. Like, keep it going. We might just stop updating it. Um, and I haven't really seen anyone brought up that possibility. They're just like, oh, the content's ending. I've seen some people like, oh, we'll see what's next. But like, what if there is no next? I don't know, just something to consider. So, I think something that would make sense is if they want to keep us going, they have to make it worth it. Get more players into it, and I think the main way to do that is a Steam version. Put Dawn of Fire on Steam. I'd know I'd play it, like, a lot if it was on Steam. Um, I think a Steam version... Would just be great to have Dawn of Fire and crazy graphics. Like, for some reason, they haven't released a graphics update. I think it'd be nice. Like, Dawn of Fire is a great looking game. And to have it a higher resolution would be awesome. And yeah, I think it should really come to Steam, have a graphics update, get more players into it. More people using microtransactions, more <laughs> revenue for a big blue bubble. Um, so I think if they want to keep this going, please do that. A Steam version. Like, please do Steam. Um, you know, they don't have to, but I think that's the best way to go about it. So, um, let's say they ended on fire. I don't know, it just ended. So let's say... You know, they're probably gonna keep it going, even, but like, you know, I, I can't talk. Everything's ending, like, the content seems pretty done, the prismatics are ending, what is next for Dawn of Fire? Now, BBB listens to the community, and I think there could be a new island at some point. Um, I don't think it'd be like another hour island i think it'd be something like star hands like something pretty different if it has exclusive monsters 
they're not gonna be exclusive for long. Let's be honest, MSN is just gonna absorb everything from Dawn of Fire just like it has over the years. I think it's no reason why Dawn of Fire is weird, like it doesn't feel like it has much to offer anymore. Like, everything's kind of in the main game now. I don't know, but that's just my opinion, but... Anyway, I think we could see a new island at some point. I think a high possibility is seasonals on the outer islands. I think they could do that once their events roll around, which will start with Spooticle Jr. in October this year. I think that's a high possibility. I think, like, Punk of Tim would go to Cave, which Cave has a lot of updates, but... <laughs> Um, one of them, one or two would go to party. I'm hoping, like, one would go to multiple as well. Um, hopefully they can get, like, you know, Dave Kerr back again for those. And hopefully they don't have to sound like chipmunks anymore. They can be adults and not be horrible. And, yeah, I think that's kind of, like, the generic... Route of Dawn of Fire, that's something I could see. If they really, really want to expand Dawn of Fire, they would do something like really big. Like something that changes it, like a new island, but like, I don't know, a new island would be insane or something. Like, I feel like Dawn of Fire is either gonna just drip feed the rest of Prince Max, have some seasonals on our rounds. Just give a slow content like, oh, here's a monster every now and then. Or they shut down, not shut down the game, but kind of stop it. Or they go insane with it, put it on Steam, and roll up crazy updates, and it can be like Mice and Monsters, and get constant updates. I think that's kind of like where I see it going, those possibilities. Um... I'd hope that it, it can thrive and be on Steam as well. But at the end of the day, I do think more people care about the main game. And I know it sounds super negative towards Dawn of Fire. It's a good game. It's cool. But it does make you wonder, is there a time... We're sacrificing to put in Dawn of Fire over the main game. Like, people play it, but like, not as nearly as many probably as the main game, especially not being on Steam. So I think they gotta take some things into consideration. I'm hoping it can, you know, keep going with lots of updates. I hope it goes down that path. But we gotta consider, like, what's best. Like, maybe it just. Doesn't I don't know. I, I know it's kinda weird that I mentioned it could end. It probably won't, but I do wonder what they're gonna do for the future. It's kinda up in the air, like are you gonna put it on Steam? No? And you know, like you're limiting your player base. Um, I feel like if it's put on Steam it'd give new life into the game, new players. New people talking about it. Um, I think they need to release a new island too. Just something fresh for the game. Or, you know, they can keep going like little content pieces at a time. Um, but yeah. So, I don't know. It's just interesting to think about the future of Dawn of Fire. I think it. it probably go either just like oh here's like a prismatic here's a seasonals on our rounds just not much content or they could really double down on dot fire and go crazy with it and real just push it to new heights or you know they could say like hey you're not gonna do much with this anymore i don't know i'm just thinking about all the possibilities you know dot fire could be very exciting in the future or it could just be like, hey, prismatics. <laughs> and those are done. And it's like, uh, what are we doing? 
Here's some seasonals on our I was like, oh man. It's interesting to think about. They've kind of reached like the ceiling of what they're doing. It's like Mice and Monsters. We all know that Epic Magicals are probably gonna come in all these variants, but eventually it ends and we have to do something new. Right? And especially if Dawn of Fire doesn't get like an, another island, like. You're really limiting yourself, so they gotta keep inventing new things to put in the game. Anyway, I'm talking way too much. This is just kind of like a yapping video, but I don't know. Um, comment below if you want a Mice and Monsters free video. I don't know, I might do that. Just talking about, you know, is it likely? Is it a good idea? Which I don't think it is. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think. I hope Dawn of Fire can... I don't know. They just gotta figure out what they want to do with it, I think. Um, and, you know, like, maybe they give it something more exclusive. Something that doesn't just go to a main game after a while. Because I feel like Dawn of Fire used to be so special. And now it just doesn't feel the same. Like, I don't know if anyone else feels like that, like, it just had, it was so unique with all the fire monsters, and now they're all in the main game, all over the place. Anyway, thanks for watching, and goodbye.